So as you can see over here, we're scraping and we're digging and we're getting this shaped out. Again, like I said before, we got to be two feet wide, right? So two feet by two feet by two feet deep. We've already started to fill this hole here in with, uh, with a bit of concrete. We have a little bit more to go. This one over here is dug in and it's perfect. So as you can see, boom, we're right at 12 inches below the common grade. So what's gonna happen next is, is that after the concrete dries, we're gonna put a piece of one inch thick horse pad on top of this concrete. Then the liner goes down over the top of that. Then another piece of that horse pad goes on top of the concrete. Now we already have our form to be able to set our sonar tube on top of the liner. And that's why we over dug it so that the rebar can go out this way and it can go out this way in all four corners to be able to hold that sonar tube that's gonna be filled with concrete to be able to support the dock. I'm really hoping that you guys are seeing step by step how this goes so that you can understand why we do everything that we do here. So one last thing is, I'm not trying to be meticulous, but I am trying to be a good pond builder. It's really important that we just go ahead and kind of float this out. Now, I have the wrong tool for the job. This is, this is a notch trowel, it's, it's used for tiling, but it still allows me at least to get a pretty smooth surface right over here. And the reason why I want that smooth surface is because when you're dealing with liner and when you're dealing with all these different variables that are gonna be going on here, we have got to make sure that we are giving our best opportunity forward. One last thing, as you can see looking at this, this is a bit of a wet mix. I'm in favor of a wet mix for this kind of an installation for two reasons. One, it does a little bit of self-leveling. Two, two is that we're going straight into the dirt. And of course the ground is gonna suck the moisture right out of this concrete like a sponge. Let me get back to work.